Hi, my name is Meg, and I am the owner of Sir Winslow Zoo. My sister Bethany and I do this together. About five years ago at a craft show, my daughter Emily saw a stuffed owl that she wanted, and I said, oh, Mommy can make that for you. And I came home, and I drew out a pattern that I liked and cut out all the pieces out of minky and um, cottons that I, I have a pretty large stash of fabric, so it wasn't a problem. I stuffed it, and of course, you put it on Facebook, right? So I had actually had enough fabric to make three of them. And um, so I put all three on Facebook, and I said, well, two of these are taken. Um, but the other one, if anybody wants it, let me know. And of course, it went immediately. I think it was 15 minutes, and it was gone. So um, it's kind of exploded from there. Lots of people... Um, have asked for other animals. That's why I kind of wait till somebody asks before I create another one. Um, llamas have been a recent creation, but everything has um, basically come off that first owl that I made. They're just variations of it, different sizes. I make everything from an 18 inch down to like three inches. So there's a good variety for craft shows and on our online sales. The reason we call it Sir Winslow Zoo um, back in the 80s. Um, we served um, funny dinners to our friends, and our um, we did some for parents' groups, too. And we had a backstory of a man named Sir Winslow Smith that went to India to count the stripes on Bengal tigers, and he moved to our house when he retired. So we had this backstory, and, and my sister and I just decided to incorporate that into the stuffed animals. So um, that's, we do it basically is a in supplementary income for our families. Um, and Beth and I just really, really enjoy working on it together. She lives in Illinois, and she sends me things, and I send her things, and it's worked really well for the both of us. So thank you for listening to my story. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.